a block of mass 1 kg is pushed up a surface inclined to horizontal at an angle of 60 degrees by a force of 10 newton parallel to the inclined surface as shown in the figure. When the block is pushed up by 10 meters along the inclined surface, the work done against the frictional force is given G value is 10 meter per second square. This block is placed on the inclined plane. When any body is placed on the inclined plane, weight of the body is resolved into two components. Actually, this is the direction of the weight of the body. But here angle of inclination is 60 degrees. So, weight is resolved into two components. This component is mg cos theta. Normal reaction n. So, here normal reaction is equals to mg cos theta. When block is moving in upward direction, so frictional force is acting opposite to the direction of motion of the body. This is the direction of motion of the body. Friction formula, frictional force is equals to coefficient of friction into normal reaction. Given coefficient of friction is 0.1. And normal reaction mg cos theta. Mass of the block 1 kg, g value 10 and theta is 60 degrees, cos 60 value 1 by 2, 2 1s, 2 5s. 0 0.1 into 5 is equals to 0 0.5 Newton. Frictional force acting along the inclined plane in downward direction is 0.5 Newton. This is the direction of the frictional force. And this is the direction of the motion of the body. The distance travelled by the body is 10 meters. These two are acting in opposite direction. In this question we have to find out the work done against the frictional force. So, work done against the frictional force is equals to Fs cos theta. Theta is 180 degrees because both acting in opposite direction. Frictional force 0 0.5 and given distance 10 meters cos theta value minus 1. So, that is equals to minus 5 joules. In options there is no negative sign. So, choose the second option, 5 joules. Work done against frictional force is 5 joules. Second option is correct.